All right. So now let's discuss the graphical analysis of a CRO. First of all, when you see this waveform on the screen, you know that that means if you've applied an AC voltage on the Y plates and your time base is on, tabhi ye wave ban rahi hai. Now, two facts that you have to remind or recall. First of all, time period, that is the time for one complete wave. So this is your time period and frequency is the number of waves that are produced in one second. Frequency is the inverse of time period. Now, when you will have this waveform, you must know that you move vertically because of your voltage gain and you move horizontally because of your X plates, which is your time base. So X plates cause horizontal movement. That's your, called your time base. Y plates cause vertical movement. That's your voltage gain. So usually you'll have this sort of a graph given with boxes and they'll at the edge, if you notice, they'll write division or centimeter. So one centimeter or one division means the same thing. It means one box vertically and one box horizontally. This is one centimeter and this is one centimeter as they're showing. So the question is that they'll give you two settings. They'll give you the time base setting and they'll give you the voltage gain setting. Look at these time base is two milliseconds per centimeter. Is ka matlab kya hai? This comes the be the value of one centimeter horizontally. Time base is horizontal, right? Time base is horizontal. So the value of one centimeter horizontally is two milliseconds. Two milliseconds per centimeter ka matlab. Ki ek dabbe ki value horizontally is two milliseconds. So two boxes kitni hogi four, three boxes kitni hogi six, or four boxes kitni hogi eight. So that tells you that this time is eight milliseconds. That's what you can quickly tell from this graph. So you have four boxes horizontally. So four boxes horizontal. And your time base setting is two milliseconds. So you multiply that with two milliseconds. So you get eight milliseconds. That is your time period because the time period is the time for one complete wave. Now they could ask you, what is your peak voltage? So you can either go this way or you can go this way. So when you look at your peak voltage, how many boxes do you have vertically? You've got two boxes vertical. And what is your vertical setting? That is 10 volts. Please don't make the mistake of saying, I've got two boxes vertical or multiply up cardinals for two milliseconds. Millisecond is going to be your second. Your time is going to be horizontal. Time base is horizontal. Voltage gain is vertical. So this is voltage gain. 10 volts has to be vertical. So 10 volts per centimeter ka matlab kya hai? Ke one centimeter vertically is 10 volts. Voltage gain 10 volts per centimeter ka matlab kya hai? That one centimeter vertically is 10 volts. So one, 10 volts another 10 volts. So you get now 20 volts. So when you do two boxes vertical into 10 volts, that will give you 20 volts. That is your peak voltage. That's a question that you can get. I hope you understand. Now, they could also ask you to calculate what is the frequency of this wave. So you know that frequency is one upon time period. What is your time period? Your time period is eight milliseconds. Now, because it's milliseconds, you know, you should know that milli is 10 is to our minus three to so write one divided by, and within brackets, you put eight into 10 is to power minus three brackets rule again in the calculator. And the answer that you get is 125 Hertz. That is your frequency. Now let's have a look at this question. So they've given you the screen of the CRO. They've given you this waveform. They've labeled the axes for you. They're saying that this value is two volts and they're saying that this value over here is 20. Look at the axis. It's time in seconds. So this value is 20 seconds. This time is mentioned in seconds and this is two volts. And they're asking you to calculate what is the voltage gain? What is voltage gain? Voltage gain is the value of one box vertically. They're asking for the time base. What is the value of time base? Time base is the value of one box horizontally. So stop the video, find the answer. So you know that the voltage gain is two volts divided by how many boxes vertically? You've got two boxes vertically. So your answer would be one volt per box 
or you could say one volt per centimeter because you know one box vertically is one centimeter so we've got two volts in how many boxes we've got two volts in two boxes so we've got one volt per box or one volt per centimeter that be one volt plus one volt gives you two volts next they're asking for time base so time base is your time period which is 20 seconds divided by the number of boxes horizontally which is four boxes so your answer would be five seconds five volts nahi. four and twenty will get cancelled get five seconds time hai na? time is second aata. five seconds per box or you could say five seconds per centimeter because you know one box is one centimeter horizontally so one box is five seconds two boxes ten seconds three boxes 15 four boxes 20 that's how you do it now let's have a look at this question a wheel produces sound waves of frequency 5 hertz the waves are detected by a microphone and displayed on the CRO so this is the waveform that you get what is this time base setting on the CRO so they have given you the frequency and they're asking you for the time base setting which time base setting so first thing you do is you calculate the time period. You know that the time period is going to be one upon frequency, which is one upon five, which is 0 0.2 seconds. Is ka matlab kya? Is ka matlab ye hai ki aapki jo ek wave hai, wo 0 0.2 seconds mein puri ho rahi. So this value over here is 0 0.2 seconds. So this value is 0 0.2 seconds. Now they're asking you for the time base setting. Time base setting is the value of one box horizontally. Time base setting is the value of one box horizontally. So you've got 0 0.2 seconds in how many boxes? You've got 0 0.2 seconds in how many boxes? You've got 0 0.2 seconds in two boxes. So 0 0.2 seconds score two boxes per divide. Kare. You will get 0 0.1 second per box or 0 0.1 second per division or you can get 0 0.1 second per centimeter all mean the same thing so your answer is b ball